Let's say you're working on an electronics project and you have a little microcontroller like this and you want to connect a port or a button. Now you could use just a bunch of wires, but that's messy. So I encourage you to dive into the world of circuit design. This is the first PCB I designed all by myself. I used a program called KiCad and I imported a footprint that is a uh, set of solder pads that line up with the microcontroller I wanted to use. I could drag and drop things, line them up, and then run these traces, which work just like wires. Getting this far was already tricky, but actually turning this into something we can manufacture is even trickier. So there's a type of software called Design for Manufacturing, and it's a type of tool that helps you fix issues in your board before you send it off to a place to actually make it. The folks from NextPCB who sponsored this short make a software that does this. You can download it or use the web version and it generates this whole report that catches a bunch of issues that I didn't even know to look for. It took a few tries, but I got my board to pass that review. I sent it off to NextPCB for manufacturing and I have this beautiful alternative to that mess of wires.